there mortals, I'm Jensen and welcome back to Dead Space. I can't for the life of me remember what we were doing in the previous episode, we're, so we're about to check our map and we're about to follow this path along. We are rerouting the power from the electrical systems. Right, gotcha. So, I have taken a little bit of a break from this game and as a consequence, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Actually, if memory serves, we just got into this area, didn't we? So we didn't really, ooh, ace, free money. We didn't really know what we were doing and we didn't explore this little room over here, did we? Why is it locked? Maybe that is exactly what we are supposed to be figuring out. Let's try and bring this here explosive with us in case someone tries to, oh, I don't know, gank us. Ganking is an absolute possibility. I hate this close quarter environment. Oh no. This is probably the worst place to have some kind of baby! Sorry, that's not what I meant to say. I did not mean to say this is the worst place to have a baby, though. Actually, now that I say it out loud and I think about it rationally, the Ishimura is probably actually the worst place to have a baby. Okay, let's run through. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm gonna take whatever that is. I'm gonna pick this baby up and I'm gonna throw it at whatever comes up for us. Like that thing right there. Boop. There you go. I'm gonna keep it on there for the electricity to kind of capture it and shock it to, what the hell just hit me? Hello? Oh, that is not what we want to do. That is pulse round. Baby! Stop it! Did I just use that thing as a shield? I think I actually may have. Okay, the baby's dead. I think we're actually killing everything with the ambience, which is pretty funny. That's scary. Okay, that was uh, effective. I don't necessarily know if we killed the baby, but we are probably going to take the spine right here. It, or not. And we're going to huck it at the baby. There it is. It's a dead baby, just over there. We're gonna take whatever bits it dropped. Some money, that's pretty, that's pretty nice, isn't it? A nice little reward for our, for our endeavors. Hello, what's going on? What is it? Is it an enemy? Piss, I don't know what's happening. What's going on? What am I being attacked by? Why the sounds? Well, apparently that's the exit, but it's literally pointing to a wall. I don't know how we would exit through that wall. Whoa, hello, Jesus! Uh, we, yeah, we fought, we fire it and then we beat it to death with our fists. This is my design. This is my design. This is my design. Baby! Nice. Can we get another one of those spines, please? No, we're going to get the whole body. Uh, there is a health pack right here, baby. Oh, it died on there. That's pretty funny, actually. Uh, what is this? Credits. Nice. And this? Ammo. No, medicine. Even better. Okay, so what is next? There is a stasis recharge station right here, so we're probably going to have to, I don't know, use stasis in this zone? That's usually why they give us those things. What is it? What's going on? I'm stopping this. Oh my god, that's a brute! No! No! Uh, go away! Uh, I'm firing, I'm firing a, a what's my doodle? That's money, okay, that's not good. Right, the brute is actually busting down the doors, which is pretty good. Uh, I'm going to start lighting its pustules on fire and I'm going to see what happens. Oh, boom! Oh, Ow! I actually just took that straight to the face. Okay, we got to get away from this thing. We don't really have any medicine to spear, do we? Where is this thing? Here it is. Uh, fire a wall of fire right there. Our sticky, sticky fire wall right there. Uh, we probably shouldn't run through it if I say so myself. Let's use the BFG. Let's use the BFG against this thing. Oh! Damn, that is effective. Uh, I'm running. That is actually very effective. Oh! Fire this gigantic BFG. Is it doing anything? I don't know if we can actually just naturally take out a brute with the with the BFG or any kind of like conventional firearm. But we can take out its pustules from a distance. Let's not get hit by that. Because I know that it's actually coming up behind us really, really fast. Really hot, really heavy. Uh, like a Papa John's pizza. Good. Okay, I'm gonna start trying to... There we go, we got it. No, we didn't. We only cut off a piece of its arm. Oh no, I didn't want to break that! I did not want to break that. Let's pick this thing up and... Or we could not pick that thing up and throw it. What is it doing? Oh, it's right up our, right up our jacksy. Gonna keep a distance. Let's pick this up and throw it at that thing. It did nothing. <laughs> it did nothing. Okay, I tried to fire that one right at its pustule, but it didn't quite take. Probably get it now. Nope, not quite. Almost though. Man, there's a high stakes. There's a very high stakes. Okay, uh, let's actually try and swap the orientation of this. So maybe we can hit a sideways wrap. Perhaps that is going to be the best option. Uh, straight thing. Oh, did I get it? No, not quite. 
That was very close. He almost actually got us. I am trying to pop him, but he seems to be absolutely killing us. Okay, we got to wait for him to do his little attack while we strafe diagonally. Oh, no! Oh. Hopefully we didn't spawn too far back, but the potential could be there. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please don't put me all the way back with the babies. Oh, we're all the way back with the babies. No! That sucks. Okay, regardless, we can just kind of stun enemies into place. Like, baby right there. Just got electrocuted too. Oh, suck to be that baby. Awesome! Pulse rounds, I'll take those off its decomposing corpse, which is uh, pretty nice, pretty nice indeed. We've got the flamethrower out. It's not amazing against the brutes. Gotta be said, not an amazing weapon against the brutes. Okay, we've got two enemies here. I think I just shot that one into place. Let's grab one of his spines, or we can pick up his cash instead. We just jack him, jack him for, for his cash. Uh, I kind of do want one of his spines though. Can I have it, please? No, I don't think you get access to their spines with ambient kills, which is a little bit of a shame, but it is something that we can live with. Oh, there's something back there. What am I being attacked by? Oh, there's something over there. Where are you? Where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? I know you're out there. Oh, hello, here he is. Okay, now that we got him once, let's uh, beat him to death with our fists. Because it seems to keep him in a perpetual stun lock as long as there's just the one of them. Let's take his spine. Absolutely fine. I'm fine for spines right now. And we'll throw it into the first baby we see. Baby! There we go. There's one, and we'll go and get another spine because they are literally free. Or we could just get the whole body. That's fine too. Baby! Baby! There it is. Got him! I didn't kill him though. There he is. Okay, he's pulling out his tentacles. No, he's dead. He's definitely dead. Uh, let's actually go this way. Let's go this way and let's see what this area has to offer. So we're going to be a little bit risky. We're going to stand on this. And as soon as it changes... Oh, no! That hurts. That hurts the pride a little bit. Okay, we're still doing the same strategy of killing baby with bomb. Baby! Okay, baby gets electrocuted. I think that's just scripted. I think we actually just waste our bombs by hitting the baby with that. So we won't do that much. Okay, I'm just gonna bring this baby in to stomp it for all of its goodies. There were no goodies. Bit of a shame. Maybe there's just no goodies. Oh no, there's goodies, there's goodies. Baby? Baby? No, Necromorph. Okay, I hit him. Uh, there is a baby coming. We could probably actually just light this guy on fire and then Dunlock attack him, good. We'll take his spine, because it's a free kill. A nice free kill. And we'll see what else is about to attack us. Okay, I heard that. It's probably behind us, right? Where is this thing? There it is. Hello, sir. How are we today? Well, obviously not that great. Okay. I'm going to light my blaze, and we got him. Uh, oh. We got his spine, but we didn't get his goodie, which he dropped on the ground right here. 500 bucks. Nice. I misspoke. 400 bucks. Okay, so the next baby we find is going to get a nice mouthful of spine. Predator style. Where is it? Where is the next baby? There it is. Got it. Thank you. I'm just going to dip over here while he fires his load off. There he is. There's the baby. He's probably going to fire his load off at us. So let's go back. Maybe we'll find another spine that we can potentially throw at him. Nope, that's money. That won't do any damage. That is a corpse. Okay, the baby has actually come in. Well, sucks to be that baby. Good grief. Right, so now we should probably think about a game plan for the giant brute, right? We should probably think of a game plan. I'm thinking maybe not the BFG. I'm thinking maybe just Plasma Cutter and we shoot its little weak spots. Oh, no, I've got a plan. 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 So that's why the stasis bench is right here. We're supposed to stasis the brute, and then we shoot him from behind, right? Okay. Boop! There we go. One stasis. And now we shoot him from behind. Uh, maybe we should get the... Okay. Plasma cutter out. Whoop, that was close. And I'm going to stasis him again. And now we run in from behind... And we shoot him in his knackers right here. All right, good. Let's get him in here close. We don't want him to hit us, but we do want to stasis him right as he kind of turns his back to us. 
Okay, where's the rest of them? Got him! Nice! Actually, that is a perfect strategy for those brutes. Gotta get used to stasis, though. Got, really gotta get used to stasis. Oh, he, he did drop a node. Nice! I don't know if we can come back and just farm him for nodes. It might be unlikely, though. I feel like it's gonna be quite unlikely that we can farm him for nodes. Uh, let's get our Lumenverfer back out. We'll reload it really quickly. We'll take a look around for loot. There's something right here that we can F. Good. Uh, that also looks like something that we're supposed to stasis. Let's go recharge our stasis again, because it's free. It's free stasis. It's free real stasis. Where is it? There it is. Okay, good. Wow, I can't believe it took me that long to figure out how to take out a brute. I can't believe I was just using guns to do it. That is so stupid. There's a couple of benches here, too. Uh, we might want to take one of the medicine packs that we picked up on our way over here. We didn't pick up any medicine packs on our way over here. But we did. I could have swore we did. But there's no medicine in our inventory. What? Well, that sucks. Okay. So I probably got to stasis this. Oop. Here we go. Stasis that. And now we got to run over. We got to divert the power. Right here. There we go. So now those things are useless and we have rerouted power. I think we may be attacked again. Power reroute from the electrical systems. That's nice. Watch the outlets. The grid's unstable. That's two. One more system and we'll have power for the ADS. Okay, so now we can go down this way that Insta killed us. Very embarrassing. And it was just a Just it was only 200 bucks down here. That wasn't even worth our time to go and explore. That sucks. Okay. We're probably gonna get attacked again, right? I I feel like we're about to be attacked again. I'm feeling a, uh, a real false sense of security where we are. Or maybe we aren't. Impressive. Okay. Bunch of spores in here. That's not amazing. What's in here? Comms access hall? Not interested. What's in there? Ah, we can go in here now, right? We can go into this, this little room. I cracked the Ishimura's Metsai reports. They're a fucking horror show. These things mold any dead tissue into a new form. One kind infects corpses, and the rest... Make more corpses to infect. That organic shit on the walls, that's dead tissue too. The crew thought it was a habitat changer. Isaac, I'm gonna run some diagnostics. I think that's death spreading. Okay, uh, thanks for the heads up. I don't know why you just dumped all of that on me. It has nothing to do with me, so we are just going to leave. I think we're done with this area, actually. We've pretty much seen everything that there is to see in here. I remember we have been into that break room that we walked past while she was speaking. And there was just a little bit of lore in there, not a lot of resources. Okay, we got two more stasis recharges. We may want to upgrade the suit for more stasis, for a higher stasis capacity. If we are going to have to start fighting brutes in this way, that is probably going to be the thing. Man, this is a long elevator. Oh, we're here. Wait, was that there before? Oh, okay. What's happening? Hello! Ah! Scorpion! I got stuck! I got stuck in an attack cycle! Okay, I'm running. I'm running away while he burns. Later! No! Oh, I think I accidentally just hit the quick time event there. Oh, that was like a Doom Glory kill! Where's its head? Julia's not still attacking! What the hell? Is it like following the sound? There's a couple of them actually. Okay. Let's uh, pick this up and we'll throw it at them. Maybe we can um, hold them off a little bit. Okay, good. Okay, we just got jumped. I don't know if that consumes health. It does consume health. That's not good. Okay, I'm going to light it ablaze and then we are going to run. We're going to run away. Is he going to jump at us? He's not going to jump at us, is he? He's going to jump at us. Okay, I'm still running. Still running. Hopefully we don't get stuck on that. Good. He is still on fire. This is still a fight of attrition. Okay, good. We're gonna light him ablaze again before we haul ass away. Do we kill him? Yeah, that looks dead to me. Okay, we got a spine. I don't know if we're gonna get attacked again by anything. Apparently the ship is uh, shaking around a bit. Let's stomp him. Okay, we got a small med pack. That's actually awesome because we desperately need more health. And um, where was the other guy? Where did he die? Is this him here? Yeah, that's definitely him. What did he drop? 
He dropped nothing. That's not very nice. Right, so let's go back into our inventory and we will use this med pack immediately. That one single med pack. We do have a lot of stuff in our pocket. We probably don't need all of this on us at this time. Pulse rifle, I'm not sure if we'll keep it on us for much longer because it's pretty subjective in use. Actually, we're probably going to use the pulse rifle to take out those scorpions. That would have been a very good use of the pulse rifle. So, next we probably want to do a scot just down here at the scot station. And then we'll move on with the actual gameplay. There we go. Do what we say. We say the wavy. What's the harm? What's the harm of scotting every once in a while? There's a reason they call it a great scot. Okay, probably have to go through this way next. Nope, we actually have to go through this elevator right over here. Uh, there is, however, right through here a shop. And I'm pretty sure we've got a bunch of stuff that we can either deposit or sell. So let's do that really quickly. Hello? I don't want to be attacked while I'm in this store again. I think this happened three times in this playthrough so far. Okay, we just got a super symmetry tether for the contact beam. Wonderful. I think that's BFG kind of uh, stuff. What does this do? Bring this part to a bench to extend the upgrade path. It doesn't tell us what it does. We also have a bunch of nodes here. Okay. Inventory, we've got too much stuff, if I can be quite frank. We probably want to get rid of this bronze semiconductor and this bronze semiconductor. And what the hell is this? Ammunition for the contact beam. Maybe we want to keep that. These power cells run like the contact beam's energy projector, but burn out quickly. Okay. Good to know. What else have we got here? There's a little exclamation mark. Ripper blades, we're not using the Ripper, and we probably won't use the Ripper for a long time. Now, what else do we want to upgrade? We could upgrade the Pulse Rifle. I don't really think it's going to be particularly useful, however. In any instance, other than just flat-out grenade damage. Maybe we buy a Power Node, but actually, if we just buy this Pulse Rifle upgrade, we get a Power Node anyway for free, which is pretty good. So we'll buy that. And now we'll come out. Hopefully, we are going to find some kind of workbench around here as well so we can deposit the upgrade we just bought. I don't see one, however. There may be one down below in the cockpit, which is ironically swinging down between the legs of the ship rather than actually being at the top, which you would assume, it being a cockpit, it, it, it would be like at the front and also up elevated, but it, it doesn't. Probably so they can see the planet. Honestly, it probably makes the sense, the most sense, to put the cockpit of a spaceship at the lowest level of where your ship is supposed to be oriented. Oh! Make us whole again. Uh, I could, I could, I could make a hole in you, if you'd like. Is that what you want? Where'd he go? Is that his leg? Did he just drop his leg on the ground and leave? It was weird. What a weird thing to do. What, an, what a really weird, weird thing to do. Oh my god! Okay, uh, this looks like a job for grenades. <laughs> yes, baby! And now flamethrower, of course. Oh uh, no, I'm, we're actually getting swarmed by these things. Okay, I'm matching E. Any more? Yep, there are, and there's also a full necromorph, which I'm just gonna beat to death, honestly. Let's just beat him to death with our flamethrower. Our flamethrower is pretty good as a melee weapon. Here we go, that was effective. That worked well, actually. What do you have to drop? A hundred bucks. That's what that entire beatdown was worth. Ooh, medium med pack. Don't mind if I do. Perfect. That encounter not only made us more work wealthy, but it also filled up our entire health pool right in front of a save station, which is pretty cool. It's a good thing we didn't save while that thing was still alive, because I was actually about to. I was thinking about it. Okay, we'll do a Scott right here. Good, the Scott has been completed. Now we push on. Hello? Anyone else down here? The hell is this? Circuit break. What is this for? Water purification? Not... That's not actually that handy. We probably just want to... Put it there, right? Why, why do we need water purification? We're not going to be here that long. We got it. The ADS cannons are back online. We really? Auto-targeting offline. Calibration data not found. Fuck. No auto-targeting. The cannons are useless. What about manual targeting? You want to go out there with all that shit raining down and target the ADF cannons manually? If I give the cannons enough targeting data, it'll recalibrate the system. 
Got a better idea? Christ. I'll open exterior access. I hope you know what you're doing. Ah, uh, thank you. I don't know why you wouldn't have done that in the first place. I just found an engineering rig. Wonderful. So that's going to upgrade uh, something useful, I would say. Okay, we're good. So I imagine he unlocked this door for it. Yeah, he definitely unlocked that door for us. Great. What about this other one? There was a locked door on the other side of here. I'm not entirely sure if we checked it out per se. Where is it? That's not it. That is a... That is a breaker. No, we want the mat, not the inventory. It's way back. Way back past this save point right. Oh, hello. Hey, going back also just gave us some immediate wealth as well. Contact energy beam? Yes, please. Break some credits. No enemies. So through here. All right, we need a master override, and we are hardly even a master ourselves. So we're probably going to have to keep that in mind for the next time we come down here. So it's unlikely right now that we are really in a bad place. I wonder why there's blades all over the windows here. It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. If it's supposed to be water purification, why is it trying to drain blood? Oh, we're going up. Great. Or not. I don't know yet. I suppose we'll find out as soon as we land. There it is. Okay. Again, why are there blades all over the walls if this is water purification? Oh, what was that? Hello? What's the plan? I'll I don't know. Cannons to one of my tools. I target an asteroid, the cannons take it out, and I recalibrate the system. We're out of options. Do it. Okay, there's an email right here. Let's read it. Security request retrieved. Oh, God. Someone stop him! This is Second Officer Sheik. I need security here right now. No one's coming. White, for Christ's sake, step away from the controls. <laughs> Really fun mechanic. I like this. Calibration complete. Excellent. Cannon auto targeting online. Wonderful. Uh, let's go and use this O2 station right here. Good. And now we're going to come down here. We're going to use. Oh, that was close. This one next, obviously. Hull integrity compromised. Oh. One. Two. Targeting system. Okay. We, we're just going to face take that one, I think. Uh, I don't see any. Comets, there's one right there. Boom, and there's one right there. And any more? Probably, actually. Probably heaps. Probably heaps around the place. There's one right there. One right there. Calibration Good. Complete. Cannon auto -targeting online. Wonderful. That's what I like to hear, Karen. And what about this? Nope, there was nothing there. Okay, let's push on to this one over here. Our whole integrity is apparently going down now, which is different to before when it just wasn't going down at all i think actually being out here is go oh, hello baby i didn't see you there for a split second for a hot minute where'd you go baby we go got him okay uh we probably should have used the oh what happened i'm actually going to fire at that baby that just attacked us using this ads cannon save a little bit of ammo i think there it is Boop. okay we can't actually do that apparently uh, we still did a- whoops, I just fired on the ship. Whoops, that's not good. There's one there, one there. Any more? A couple up here. One there, one there. There we go. One there, a bunch there. Uh, let's use all of these ones. Data complete. Really? Recalibrated. Excellent. Systems enabled. Now, I, I was caught off guard by this baby. The ADS cannons are online shipwide. Thank God. Engaging autopilot. Get yourself inside, Isaac. I think I've figured out our next move. 
a purple thing over here. Why would, I, why would I go inside? What is that? What does it do? Okay, let's breathe. Let's take a deep breath. We'll go all the way to the end here and we'll see if there's any goodies. Okay, we can't go that way. Good to know. Okay, let's turn around and we will try and find our way back. Maybe there is a node up here. Perhaps. Who knows? Who knows? I don't see any nodes. We did find that purple thing. I don't know what it does, but I suppose we'll find out when we get back to the Ishimura. Which, believe it or not, uh, is right here. Man, this thing looks like it's straight out of Star Wars, doesn't it? It looks like one of those uh, Star Destroyers. One of the Sith Star Destroyers. What the hell is that for? It can't be like a, a planet miner or something. Well, maybe it is. Maybe it is a planet miner. Who knows? Okay, let's get back on the ground here. Get a little bit grounded. And we're going back inside where there is fresh air. We'll reload our gun. We'll get our flamethrower back up. Asteroid cutter? What? The contact beam allows us to fire an asteroid cutter. Jesus! That is potent. I think. It sounds potent. Okay, let's do a Scott real quickly here. Very nice. Wonderful. Save complete. And now we're pushing. Now we're gonna push. We're gonna push really hard. Isaac, Hammond, I just intercepted a transmission for medical. Someone's down there? See what you make of this. <laughs> this is senior medical officer Nicole Brennan. Nicole! Remember me? Medical is a sanctuary. I'm Isaac! Your ex-husband! Please join us. Or boyfriend! I'm a survivor! Nicole. I'm going back to medical. Makes sense. I'll head to the crew deck and look for survivors from the bridge. I'll be in touch. Uh, can deck. you... Wonder if he knows something we don't. Okay, good. Oh, apparently we're not supposed to go back to the captain's nest. Okay, looks clear enough. Okay, chapter five, Lethal Devotion. Wonderful. Oh, there's a couple of spines here. And uh, what the hell is that? Oh my God. Shall I compare thee to a summer's day? Is this a face hugger? Is that like an actual verified face hugger? Face hugger? Face hugger? There is a burn severed head right here. That's funny. Okay. Is that a text log? No, audio. Nice. I came to the bridge looking for you, but it is completely fucked. I'm not sticking around in case whatever did it comes back, and neither should you. It looks like the admin staff went to the mining deck to meet up with the other survivors. I'll head there too. If you aren't with them, I'll find a way to contact you. I promise. Okay, science provides bounty. That is an excellent quote too. Thank you so much for watching. Right up here, you're gonna find the playlist for Dead Space 2023, and right up here, you're gonna find another playlist that I think you'd really enjoy. And of course, just down there is the description of this video where you will find the link to my Discord where you can talk to me and my community personally. And until I make the next episode, thank you so much for watching. I will see you again. Goodbye.